Kando na hayo takriban walinzi 2700 wa misitu wanapokea mafunzo kwa lengo la kuimarisha ulinzi katika juhudi za kuhifadhi misitu kwa mujibu wa afisa msimamizi wa chuo cha utekelezaji wa sheria za misitu cha Gilgil Apolani Mwandiga mpango huo ni sehemu ya juhudi za serikali za kuhifadhi misitu hakikisho hilo linajiri huku walinzi kote nchini wakisubiri kwa hamu siku ya kimataifa ya walinzi inayoadhimishwa kila mwaka tarehe 31 mwezi Julai Tunawasili kwenye chuo cha utekelezaji wa sheria za misitu mjini Gilgil kuliko na shughuli nyingi. Afisa msimamizi wa chuo hiki, Apolinari Mwandiga, anatueleza hatua za mafunzo wanazofaa kupitia kabla ya kufuzu. Ana taken through uh, various uh, units about 20 units to ensure that we impact the necessary skills, knowledge and competences that will allow them to do their work in all the stations that will be deployed after the training mafunzo hayo ni pamoja na ufundi wa nyanjani na mbinu zingine mazoezi ya kimya maonyesho ulinzi bila silaha na pia talanta inahitajika hapa. Askari walinda misitu wasioshurutishwa kujaribu kuokoa misitu iliyoelekea kuvulishishwa close it all and the scroll will be done for today welcome Asante sana Darwin Charles kwa kunipofuta hii tena niweze kumfahamisha mtazamaji wetu popote alipokuwa hii leo Mwandiga anasema mbali na mafunzo masala mengine pia huwa yanazingatiwa and also they are taken through medical tests during recruitment to allow them now come and take this rigorous training uh, which requires a lot of uh, somebody who is totally who can make a, a judgment on the work is going to uh, to do in the field mtaala ubadilishwa mara kwa mara ili kuhakikisha mbinu mpya ya ujuzi zinatumiwa na hali ni vivyo hivyo wakati mchakato wa kuajiri Hukusi kwa kimataifa ya walinzi wa misitu kikaribia mwandiga anasema kuwa kuna haja ya masala kadhaa kujadiliwa kuhakikisha walinzi wanafanya kazi bila matatizo. Uh, we want to see the welfare of our rangers including issues of uh, medical schemes, issues of uh, protection, uh, equipment is enhanced or improved to ensure that the challenges they've met are some of them getting injuries uh, some of them uh, broken uh, limbs and whatever we minimize that through uh, having maybe better weapon equipment uh, surveillance equipment and all that so that as we proceed maybe next year as we celebrate the same event we have got less maybe injuries or fatalities mafunzo haya yanaendelea hadi wanapokuwa tayari ambapo wanafunzu na kupelekwa katika maeneo mbalimbali yenye misitu humo nchini sarafina robi darubini